Hey guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm building another build that is oddly shaped and it's another letter this time as it was last week I think and yeah it's the letter Y so it even fits well with YouTube because it's the same letter as the word and yeah I decided that I wanted it to be a bar just because I wanted to build a bar and I thought the shape would lend itself well to that particular lot type and as you can see I decided to make an interesting staircase to the entrance of the bar and I had quite a large well toilet area because I wanted the whole front to be the toilet just because I didn't really want it to be split up otherwise. I thought that made the most sense. And as you can see, I also made a quite large platform for the back yard area in a sense. And I will put down several tables there as well. And then I did some doors and windows to put down everywhere and I decided to make it quite open in general and make put down a lot of windows but I just put down a few of them at the moment later I will put down more and then I completed the toilet so I put down actual toilets and also some toilet paper and later I will yeah complete it for real and put down things as well and I decided that I wanted to put down some fountains in those cutouts that I had and because I couldn't put fountains directly next to the platforms I needed to make the staircase that is made from the platforms a little bit larger in size. Then in one of the arms of the Y I put the bar that is a requirement for the lot type and I decided on that particular counter just because I really like it and I think it looks really cool and kind of modern without it looking like plastic because I think the I think it's the third one it looks a little bit like plastic and I don't like using it all that often and now I'm putting down those sinks that I was talking about earlier in the toilet area and as you can see I decided to be a little bit fancy and not put down sinks in every single counter that I put down just so it's a little bit spaced out. I thought it looked kind of fancy and yeah more upscale than usual. And in the other arm of the Y I put down lots of tables to sit at and of course also chairs and I put those down and try to space them out so it still makes sense that everything is covered. And where in the arm that also houses the bar, I decided to also put down the TV and stereo just because that area is like the entertainment area and the other area is the like eating area. That was what I decided on. And as you can see, at first I only put down one TV, but I quickly decided that the other area would also um, benefit from a TV. And I decided I put down two of those two-seater uh, couches for each TV, just because that made sense in my eyes. And as you can see here, I'm just fiddling with the placement of the tables a little bit. And then I also changed the backyard or outside eating area and included a fountain as well and some tables and chairs. And then I had like the general layout. Later of course I will fiddle with it some more. But after I had that I decided to put down more windows everywhere and I spaced them out a little bit and in general I put down a lot of windows. I just like putting down a lot of windows in public lots. It makes it seem 
Laura Boom and I think it fits well with that because in public lot usually it is a lot more open than of course in like residential lots and I made use of the half walls that we have access to and afterwards I decided to color everything and as you can see I chose like a minty green I really like that color and I think it looks like neutral enough that it isn't like overpowering as a color but it still is a color because just beige or gray is often a little bit too boring but like a really stark color oftentimes is a little bit too overpowering and just makes it look a little bit too stark so I like using this particular color and I think it looks really fancy so I like using that I think the last few builds that I did or the next few builds are going to feature this color quite often just because I really like it and now I'm in like in the decorations part and putting down some of those and as you can see in the bar area I put down that fruit bowl and I also put down some carpets for the TV areas and then I searched for some more things and I decided on curtains I used those dorm panel curtains I think they are called which I use quite often I like using them but of course I would like a little bit more variety sometimes but they just fit really well especially with the windows that I like using that I have used here as well they just fit well so yeah oftentimes I don't really feel like anything else makes sense and now I'm putting down some plants everywhere just to cover that and make it look like normal and lived in and yeah not as boring as it could be and then I also did the back area for the bar and put those things down so some storage I really like using making that space even though of course it isn't actually something that is used in The Sims because you don't need to store anything but I like pretending it to be there and then I finished it up with some landscaping now you can see some screenshots of the build I hope you like it you can download it from the gallery my ID is TGG Sims same as my YouTube channel name I also hope that you liked the video and will consider pressing the thumbs up button and subscribing thanks very much for watching and have a great week bye